Robin, cool. once again, you've, you've burned us away. I, I can't quite get over how this man comes up and he, he kind of holds a, a, a mirror up to disability and technology and enables us to really understand the difference that, that technology can make in people's lives. And you, you know, you, you never fail. I've, I've listened to you do a variety of speeches for a number of years and every time you do it, I, I learn something new and... Um, I frankly feel a little bit humble about it, and you are an amazing presenter, so thank you. Um, you are genuinely an inspiration. I have been involved with the um, Tech for Good Awards since their inception. I have the delight of being Head of Education at BT. Um, my name's Liz Williams. Um, Nigel and the team at um, AbilityNet came to us five, five, five years ago with this idea of Tech for Good Awards, and our first reaction was, somebody must be doing this already. And of course they weren't, and, and the, the event has grown. And uh, we have seen so many fantastic organisations. Uh, some of you in the room are just so inspirational, some of the stories we've heard. Organisations like, like Life Lights, which was one of the first organisations I, I saw win an award that was working with children in hospices, bringing technology to really help them as they were coming to the end of life and make, make their lives much more um, enjoyable. And ditto um, organisations like Barclays, who um, have, uh, along with BT, but we need to say that, have been really investing in inclusive services. Um, this year, um, they've given me a most amazing job. They've asked me to, um, to uh, well, to look at the special awards. Every year, we nominate somebody to receive the Tech for Good Special Award. Um, somebody who stands as an example to others of all that these awards stand for. Um, just trying to think who's won it. So Stephen Hawking won it in, uh, in 2012. That was the same year that he appeared in the opening ceremony of the London Olympics. Um, Dame Stephanie Shirley, she's uh, actually known as uh, Dame Steve Shirley. Um, she, um, she inspired others with the way that she's managed a tech career. I think it's a little bit of an indictment that she had to change her name and become a man in the process, but you know, she is the most inspiring woman and I love her a lot. And then Jimmy Wales for sharing his passion for knowledge and, and telling the story of, of uh, Wikipedia. Well, this year, it's no different. We found somebody who is a wonderful communicator, who is special in so many ways. He talks at events to a huge range of audiences, from, te <laughs> from techies to business people like me and Disability Network. And whatever he does, he never fails to have that audience there. He enthralls them and inspires them and he educates them. Not only is he an amazing communicator, he's somebody who's truly, genuinely a global expert in his field. He works in a charity in the UK. He provides um, <laughs> expert advice and support to clients that range from multinationals to charities and startups and tech innovators. And everybody that knows him and works with him is inspired by him. He helps us to understand and learn from differences and to challenge us and uh, invest in our own time and effort to find out more. Um, Robin. If you haven't guessed it, I am unbelievably delighted to say that uh, you are this year's winner of the Tech for Good Special Award.